One of my favorite foods at the German Christmas market or at fairs was always the fried mushroom with garlic sauce dish. And I heard from a few of you that you really would like me to make a video recipe for this delicious dish. It is very easy to make and super fast and you can serve it as a main dish, an appetizer or even as a snack. I usually start to make the sauce and just mix all ingredients together. As always, you can find the full printable recipe with all ingredients when you click on the link in the video description. The garlic sauce is so incredibly delicious and goes totally well with anything fried. And it's a great addition to baked potatoes too. I just love it. It's so yummy. So even if you don't like mushrooms, you have to try this garlic sauce. I've already cleaned my mushrooms with a damp kitchen paper and just cut off the stems. But don't waste them. You can use them for a mushroom soup or a stock to make a delicious gravy. And if you have larger mushrooms, just cut the heads into halves or quarters. I sliced my onion and I chopped a bunch of parsley. A lot of people experience while frying mushrooms that they will release a lot of water and will get soggy. But this is easily preventable if you follow these three small tricks. It is important to coat the pan with a thin layer of vegetable oil or lard. I find a cast iron skillet works best, but you could use a grill pan on your barbecue too. Heat the pan on high before you add the mushrooms and then fry them for about two to three minutes before you stir them lightly and then fry them for another two minutes. It is very important to don't stir them constantly or salt them as this would release the water immediately from the mushrooms and you would more saute them instead of frying them. Then add the onion slices and fry them with the mushrooms together for about another two to three minutes. And now it's time to add some flavor with butter and the spice blend. For the spice blend there are several options and you will find them all in the recipe post. And now you are ready to serve the dish. Sprinkle it with some parsley and add some of the delicious garlic sauce. I love to serve mine with traditional roasted bread slices, but they are amazing with french fries or a baked potato too. Guten Appetit!